600 meters turn left GPS. Hello fellow fellows. On this episode, meron ako ipapakita sa inyo na kakaiba na nangyayari dito sa Melbourne. It's a phenomenon in nature. Nangyayari lang ito during high heat in summer dito sa Melbourne and it's called the Pink Lake in Westgate. Welcome to the Westgate Park, everyone. For your information, this is the Pink Lake. You know, fellow fellows, it's almost like it was deliberately engineered for Instagram photos. But Melbourne's Pink Lake is all natural and has turned rosy green. Nestled in an industrial part of Melbourne, commuters passing it on the Westgate Bridge might be forgiven for thinking it was a result of a toxic spill. But they would be wrong. The bright pink color in the salt lake is caused by a natural phenomenon. One of the main reasons for this change is salt and lots and lots of salt. Although the lake already has lots of it, it only turns pink when salt levels are higher than usual. Hello fellow fellows, nandito tayo sa salt lake or pink lake dito sa ilalim ng Westgate Bridge nagtataka yung karamihan kung bakit namumula yung water dito and I found out from uh, one of the signs here na para palang red tide itong area na to kapag uh, summer or you know high temperatures nagbabago yung temperatura dun sa water and it causes yung mga alg algae dun sa water to change color on normal days it would just be green pero ngayon it's a bright pink tanyo naman highly unusual but definitely a tourist attraction According to Parks Victoria, the lake first turned pink in December and January of 2012 and 2013 and has turned pink almost every summer since then. There are several factors for this change, including algae combinations, the outdoor weather, and water temperatures and water depth. It must all be right for the water to turn pink. I remember when I was in the Philippines, I would take walks along Manila Bay when I was in college. And, you know, on a wide angle, everything looks so picturesque, you know, especially the sunset. But if you walk to the beach, you'll see trash everywhere. It all looks nice on a wide angle. But when you get to see everything close up, it's filled with rubbish.
According to Parks Victoria, the salt lake turns back into its normal green color when the weather cools and rainfall increases. So it's always best to see the salt lake while the weather is still warm. Also, people are warned to stay away from the lake's sensitive edge so that accidents may not happen. <laughs> According to Wikipedia, Victoria's northwest remote areas also show a series of salt lakes that turn a wonderful deep pink in the hot weather. Lakes like Crosby, Becking, Kenyon, and Hardy in the Murray Sunset National Park are popular tourist attractions. According to Wikipedia, Western Australia has several pink lakes as well, like Lake Hillier near Esperance and Hut Lagoon in the state's Midwest, which are also well known to tourists. Hut Lagoon attracts hundreds of tourists each year and has become popular particularly with Chinese travelers as visiting the lake has become something of a status symbol in China. Alright fellow fellows, thank you for watching this episode. I hope you like, share, and subscribe and comment down below. And I'll see you in future updates. Bye!